Welcome to Dexter Plays Arc Evolved. Uh, now that we got a fire going, you can see what's going on. I got floating obelisks. I got lights from the sky. And I got dinosaurs. Well, at least nothing's tried to eat me yet. That's that's always a bonus. Can I make uh make my shirt yet? Let's make a shirt and I don't have enough uh I don't have enough fibers. Let's let's take, take a lot of fibers. Let's uh let's collect some more some more berries and some more fibers. That pterodactyl seems to be leaving me alone. But I got my spear if he should change his mind. I think I hear I hear one of them dodo birds. That's good meat. That's good eating. Where are you, dodo bird? You're here. You hiding under this bush? Can't hide from you forever. Go ahead. Make another noise. I'll clear out all these bushes till I find you. Uh, Dodo's hiding from me. Put on my shirt and pants. Come on, Dodo, where are you? Did you get stuck up here in the corner? I don't see you. But you know what? Hey, this uh, this looks like a pretty good place to build a hut or something. I hear you. I'm gonna slowly remove everything you can hide behind. It'll be mine, Dodo. Yeah, that axe works pretty well for uh, getting some wood out of this thing. I better in the uh, Pick here works pretty well, but stripping out that that wouldn't make him attach instead. So uh, that's that's good to know. Berries. Dodo, where are you, Dodo? First, what the? Oh god! I thought there was a, another critter over there. Dinosaurs. Whose favorite dinosaur? Raptors, T Rexes. Wait a minute. Raptors, T Rexes. Oh god! I bet you there's something out here that's gonna eat me. Now I really want to make a place to hide. Better collect more stuff to get there. Move quickly. There's that darn dodo sound again. Sounded like he was over here. I, I hear him. How is he hiding from me? Is he up on the roof? Up, up on the top of the plateau? I don't see no... Really? He's taunting me. A little bird is taunting me. I will have you, bird. I will have you and cook you up. Mm. 
is my beach. Clear off all this stuff here. There's a tail? That must be one of those birds again. The pterodactyl. I still don't see that darn bird. Maybe it's just birds. Maybe it's just birds here. I'm, I, that would be fine by me. <gasps> oh, good. Get some food. Just wander around over here and see what there is to see. Beach feels kind of open. Kind of vulnerable. I want to keep an eye on that obelisk as well. See anything else out here? Maybe, uh. Maybe I'm just stuck in an island. One around. It's, it seems tropical around here. Got some pterodactyls flying about. That's. What? And a turtle. You know, this could be paradise. Except for the fact it's kind of hot out. Wander on up here. See what's at the top of here. <coughs> hey, Kane. I bet you that's uh, pretty good for fiber. That's yeah, all right. Give some shade. Drill my way on through. It's always good to have a bit of fiber. Some fiber in your diet. Hello, turtle. Feeling pretty comfortable around here. Look at that. Nice and... Whoa. Is that a brontosaurus? Okay. You know... The place is not overrun. There's some turtles here. There's brontosaurus. There's going to have to be something carnivorous around here. Otherwise, these things would be everywhere. I don't see anything. Um, those, those don't look so friendly. Wagon tails, and yeah, they don't look friendly. I bet you those things are a little aggressive. Hey, hey, stay away. Not sure I want to go over there. <laughs> you know, as I, even as I walk and breathe, I feel like I'm learning more and more. Let's go over here. There's an edge to this stuff here. I want to sit down and contemplate what I got. What I, what I remember now that I'm seeing things. What? There's a big parasaur. I don't think these are uh, aggressive. I think those are... Wow, you're noisy. I think those are uh, herbivores of my old classroom education reminds me correctly. Those kind of look like some kind of uh, raptor or something, like a little T-Rex. You think about this, you know? All this running around is uh, making me move a little bit better. But uh, we're going to need a a little place to, to stay. So let's uh, let's make ourselves a, a little a little hut. I think we should make ourselves a hut. We're gonna need to have a floor, a roof, a wall for two or three, and I think that will. Uh, That'll be good. That'll give me uh, 
at least a little place to go into for now. And as I make some more of these, maybe I'll remember how to make a, a little entrance like a door and swing that open and close. This, this is pretty easy so far. Get a little bit more fiber. Where do I want to put it? You know, I, I, I feel like I want to have access to the greater part of the island without being in the greater part of the island. But I also don't want to be isolated out in Timbuktu whenever I want to do some wandering. So, um, I'm thinking maybe right up in here somewhere. This gives me a few directions I can go in if I want to. Yeah. Yeah. And I got uh, I got the water right down there if I want to go take a swim. I think I like it. I think I like it. I'm going to just put something right here, I think. Let me see here. I'm going to plan out my... my future place. I think put a floor. No, that's a that no 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 I need to put the floor down somewhere. Maybe um right there. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Um put the door away from the openings I think so uh, we'll put the uh, walls put a wall right here Put another wall here, and one right there, I think. And we'll have the door opening this way. That way we've got a, the wall to our back for, uh, to the rest of the island. And then, uh, the roof. Keep, uh, keep the rain off. Uh, now do I want to... See, I can actually offset that, huh? Make a little place around the edges where I can, uh, catch some, some shade, or... Get out of the rain if I need to. I like that idea. Unfortunately, it means that I'll need some more uh, sections of roof, but I don't have enough thatch for that. So let's uh, let's go get some thatch. If I remember right, using the pick will give me some more thatch. So we'll do that. We'll use the pick. We'll get some more thatch. We'll deforest this area, which actually gives me a, a safe zone to be able to look around and see what's coming at me. clear the ground. I'll have to keep this area clear. Kind of feels to me like any place that I put down my my roots like that, the area around it probably uh, won't grow anything. There, I think I've picked up a bunch of thatch. Let's, uh, let's see what we can do with that. We need uh, three more roofs. Still need more fiber, huh? Yeah. Intensive building things. But I'm learning. It never seems, feels like every time I make something, I learn a little bit more. Every time I gather something, I learn a little bit more. Every time I walk, I learn a little bit more. And it's just... Things are coming back to me now. I feel like parts of my brain are opening up as I gain more knowledge. And it's becoming more comfortable for me to create these pieces of building. I was a builder in my past life. entirely possible. I feel like I'm acclimating. Nice. I like that weed in my, my house. Clear the weeds around my house. I'm not sure I like the neighbors. I might have to go do something <gasps> about that. <gasps> 
God, it's hot out. And I'm thirsty. I think I'm uh, going to go take a look at this water. It doesn't look too bad. But, uh, ah, much cooler. You know, this is kind of a nice take a pool. Just dump in here, swim around. And then, you know, the the water's not even salty. It's uh, it's good water. That's weird. Why would the water be fresh and good to drink? Huh. Guess I'm not in Kansas anymore. Well, I've got my little place. I've got a spot to sit down in. You know what? I think I'm gonna I'm gonna move my campfire over here. Put down campfire. Have a little place to sleep. This is working out pretty good for me. I think, uh, I think this just might be okay. Let's, uh, let's put this somewhere where I can actually see around me while I'm messing around with my campfire. How about if we put it over here somewhere? This looks good. There. There we go. Uh, wow, it's hot out. I wonder, uh, get in the shade. Does that help me any? You know, it still feels like I'm missing something. I must be missing a, a door or something there. Ah, uh, boy. Well, I'm going to need more, uh, more things for that. So, I'm going to grab some more. Wow, oh, man, I broke my pick. You know, uh, it seems like that's just something I gotta repair. Not quite as much as making a new one, but at least, you know, it's my trusty pick. Grab more thatch and some more wood, and then uh, I'll be ready to do some more. You know what I, I might do? In that little hut? I might make it bigger. What do you think? Should I make it bigger? Yeah. I should make that bigger. Got my brontosaurus flying around, my pterodactyl, my turtle, and the unfriendly neighbors. Uh, gonna have to come back and deal with those neighbors. Clear up the area here a little bit. It's kind of messy. A little hungry. Yum, yum, yum. Handful of berries. That's filling up my belly. It's filling up my problem pretty good. I might want to create something to store my stuff in, too. Oh, look at that dodo down there. He's, he's, he's swimming. I don't think so, dodo. You're mine. Oh, day. I guess he drowned down there. Seems like maybe dinosaurs can drown in the water. Okay. Well, I'm going to go take a nap. It's too hot out. Ah, good night. Thanks for watching another episode of Dexter Plays. Please leave a like or subscribe and post any tips or tricks down below.